Hello, we're back to Oxygen Not Included, recovering from that black hole disaster. Um, when it had last, my last save was at one cycle 146, so I basically replayed up to 150 to catch up about where I think we left off. Um, the one thing I did differently, well, first of all, when the portal came due, um, they only had a little pile of sandstone, so I took the pile of sandstone on offer. Let's switch back to Rikito. And the one thing I did different was I slightly reconfigured where the element sensor and the, for the pipe to feed the bristle blossoms, I sent it up instead of down. Just because I felt I would use this extra few spaces here so to have a little more buffer and have the shutoff closer to the um, source of water coming in just in case to prevent any potential backlogs. Otherwise, I've got this dug out again. Everything else is pretty much as it was. Um, taking the time to replay that, I also thought about a few things that I'd like to do next. Um, let's get this running while we're at it. All right. Um, so over here on Rikato, I wanted to maybe drain this water out from up above, drain it down, and then there is room in here for water, and then maybe go up and try to build a telescope up at the surface. So I think if I just dig straight up, I will make a bit of a mess, but, you know, we'll wipe it up anyway. There's the workers on this planetoid are often sitting around looking for things to do, so let's give them something to do. Let's go up here and then maybe put an airlock in. Oops, there's the mess, and then we'll go all the way up to the surface and put in a telescope. Not that there's anyone here who can operate a telescope, but at least we've uh, got it started. We'll need to power these items, so let's run the power up. Alright, so that's something to work on for over here. I think they've also got some random digging up. I wanted them to finish digging up more of the polluted mud things like that. Ah, how bad of a mess is this? Oh, I filled up the... This is not great. I did not want my refrigerator filled with water. <laughs> okay, maybe a little bit more of a mess than I had anticipated. Oh, and it's spilling into here as well. Well... Let's put a mesh tile in there. Oh well, okay. They'll deal with that later. They've also got some miscellaneous digging they can do and sweeping and other cleanup work over here. Unreachable build. Why would they not? Oh. Let's make sure they can get across here. I'm also going to try to clean up. I see little pockets of polluted oxygen around here that I'd like to clean up. All right, now let's go back to our main planet. Oh, the other thing I did for the rocket ship, I slightly reconfigured I would like to have a sort of a second floor where I can put a um, refrigerator that's so that eventually later on I can put the an orbital telescope or orbital um, research station over here and fit it in I don't have the I'm not ready for that yet but in the future I will be all right so canister MC let's let's start filling up this thing with gas for food let's put in something that won't go bad like um Nutrient bars, or what else? Muckroot. And do I have anything that I want to start dumping in here? Not right now. Maybe sand. Because eventually they'll, they'll need sand on the other planet. Okay, but let's go. So my goal for today is to get this, to get the rocket ship finished up enough that I can actually send it. How are we doing here? I've got a thousand kilograms of copper. Let me switch this to sweep only. I've got a thousand kilograms of copper. Let's add another thousand. And this time let's add to it um, 
sand, I guess? Because I'll want some filtration medium on this other asteroid. Okay, now we got the long pause for the saving. Let's see if sand is getting delivered somewhere else. Oh, and I want to make sure I'm not sweeping up any more copper, because we've got enough copper. Let's not sweep that. Okay, so the copper's not getting swept. That's fine. Let's look for sand to sweep. And make sure. This is my high priority. Sand. Let's sweep some sand and throw it in that rocket ship. Oh, it looks like they're already picking it up. Where are they going? Hopefully we're taking it up. Let's follow Mecha Ren. Where are you going, Mecha Ren? Looks good. Looks like they're doing what I had hoped. Nice. Oh no, they're putting it all the way on the inside. I want the sand in here. Uh, what is going on? Oh, this is... Let's take off the sweep. No, I want to keep sweep only. And maybe I should turn this off. They're going a little bit too too crazy here. Alright. So let's find some sand to sweep up and make sure I get it delivered. Sweep. That's 12 tons? Whew! Okay, that's, that's more than enough. If they just grab some of that, we'll be okay. Some other things I thought of I wanted to do. All right, uh, where's my oxygen? Uh, not running. Empty pipes. This is a problem. Water should be coming in here. Desalinator requires emptying. Okay, so somebody get, needs to get over here and get on the get on the ball here. What kind of job is that? Do I not? Maybe it's tidying? Tidying job. I'm going to check the schedule and or the priorities make sure somebody is set to do tidying. Uh, Lyra does a little bit of tidying. Mecha Abe, let's have you work on tidying too. Somebody's got to get that working until that gets... Oh, there we go. Lyra. Let's get that empty old sand particles out of there. Uh, what's going on? Still not finished. Alright, we still have a shortage of oxygen here as well. Alright, Lyra, get this done. The water must flow! Okay, so the plan was... I have this filter here that's filtering pure oxygen. But I think this is already doing a very good job of keeping the oxygen pure pumping out anyway so I don't think I need this filter anymore and it's a little drain of power so I'm gonna get rid of that and then just run a straight you know let's go like that so we're getting rid of the oxygen filter I wanted to increase the flow. It looks like oxygen is getting really bad here. Probably a good share of this is because this filter, the um, desalinator was not working. So now we got water flowing. Okay, we've got air pumping again. But still, we didn't have much air coming in down here. And my thought was either to open up this space. Oh, somebody's trapped on Rikito. Who's trapped? Oh, that's not good. Okay, let's uh dig your way out of there. Oh, you really are stuck. What do we have? Mafic rock? Uh Mafic Rock. Build a platform out of Mafic Rock, and maybe even a ladder. Make sure the ladder is out of Mafic Rock, too. Or 
Where's Mafic? There we go. Okay, Devin? Why are you not building? Let's get this built. Don't suffocate, Devin. Okay, maybe get rid of this ladder that you're standing on. And get out of there. And then build this, take care of it slowly. You know, let's get this sealed up before I lose all my oxygen to outer space. Right now I'm just venting all this oxygen right up the, it's flying out to open space. Okay, get up there you guys. Six should prioritize it. All right, so that's, hopefully that'll get taken care of. I think I don't need this carbon skimmer here anymore. Certainly there's a lot of carbon there, carbon dioxide, but I'd rather let the carbon dioxide fall down, vacuum it up, and then feed it to the, um, you know, the slicksters on the other colony. And while I'm at it, I think it's about time that I finally built a fireball. Copper? I don't know how much space I've got here, but let's... I'm gonna run out of copper if I'm not careful. Maybe this conveyor chute should go a little bit further away. Or maybe I'll even just, um... Drop it off over here. This is where I'm dropping off lead or whatever comes from the other colony. How are we doing for oxygen? Is this pumping going again? Nope. Alright, let's check. Get this oxygen line done. We got carbon dioxide flowing. It looks like carbon dioxide is flowing. It's flowing up, up, up. Let's shut this off. I don't know for sure where it's flowing yet. But let's check the ventilation. All right, it looks like it is feeding the rocket, which is almost full. It... All right, it looks like it filled up and now it's just venting the rest into space. That's fine. Yeah, so eventually I want... Oh, there's a lot of crap coming in here as well. Polluted oxygen. Well, I think that's okay. Because I think if I feed polluted oxygen to the other planet, the slicksters will just ignore it, and maybe I'll put a deodorizer down there. And if polluted oxygen goes up into the rocket ship, I'm pretty sure that this style rocket engine will just eject it into space or not take it. So that's... I don't think that's a problem. Uh, we need this canister filling run, filler runner running. Yeah, so getting the flow of oxygen, that's that's a pretty big deal for me right now. Let's keep that flowing up. And maybe let's get some other oxygen. This is sort of backlogged. I would like to maybe use this pipe to send some oxygen down and around. Help get some more into the rest of the base. All right, did we get rid of this? Let's see. So we've got a water pipe that I no longer need. I wonder, instead of, um, maybe instead of doing that, I should just redirect it back up. Like that. If I redirect the water, It'll just come into this flow and pass through, go to the plants. Oops. Looks like I was too quick to get rid of these. Okay, let's get that up there. I no longer need this coming down here. Uh-oh. All right, looks like we're gonna make a mess. 
Spilling water. Well, today, I guess it's about messes. It's about getting the rocket ship launched, but it's also about messes. Let's take a look at the rocket ship and see how we're doing. Okay, I've got sand and copper. What else do I want to send? Let's go up to 3,000 and let's try to feed some lead up there as well. Let's add lead. And again, sweep only, but let's make sure I'm not sweeping up any more of that sand. I thought there was a giant pile of sand that I was sweeping. Well, hopefully they leave it. Let's find that lead. And let's sweep that lead. I want them to sweep the lead and throw it up on the rocket ship. I'm just gonna hang out here and keep my eye on it. Can't tell if it's paused or not. There we go. How are we doing for the food in here also? There's no food stocked in here. I might have to say sweep the food up here. I'm looking for muckroot and nutrient bars. Do I have muckroot? Yeah, I do have muckroot. Alright, let me uh, take a peek and look for where muckroot is. Okay, so let's make this a slightly lower priority, dump the muckroot out of it, and sweep it up and maybe they will take it to the rocket ship. Oh, and this, I think I'm done in here. Let's take a quick final look. Ventilation, looks okay, this will be our, eventually will be our saunas. Plumbing, we've got going in and out. These are done. All right, these guys, I need to um, make sure that I'm going to be able to handle plumbing. I just want to get this all finished so that I can seal it without worrying about it in the future. Let's get rid of this vent. And I think I need to have plumbing come back in from the saunas when they turn the steam into water. That'll need a place to come back in. And I want that to be a higher priority than the slowly slow drip of the um, steam turbines. So these can go here and here. Is that the way it goes? Come in here, join together, go down like that. Might not be the right way of doing it. And let's get this insulated pipe. So this here is going to be where my saunas go to. And once these are done, I think then I can steal this whole place in here because it still has a vacuum. All right, let's take a look at the spaceship. Copper, I have even more sand. That's too bad. I wanted lead in there, not sand. Somewhere I have probably a job to sweep up sand and I want them to take the sand and not the lead. I mean, I want them to take the lead, not the sand. The lead is all gone, so they must have dumped the lead somewhere. All right, they didn't dump it here. Where are they going with the lead? How much lead is that? That's a lot of lead. Where are you going? It looked like you were picking up the lead. Lead. Let's make that a high priority. And see what kind of blueprints we have available. 
I think I've got a lot of lag right now. I'm sitting around 25 frames per second, so let's not take any more dupes. Oh, he's picked up lead. Where is it going? Where's the lead going? Oh, you're making wires, I bet. Yes. Okay. And besides, I ended up... Do I go up to 4,000? Let's get some lead in here. And not sand. Don't sweep any sand. I wonder if I need to say sweep only for that rocket. Oh! Oh, we delivered lead, yes! Let's deliver a little more lead. Nice. Alright, so now we've got lead, sand, copper, and just in case, I think let's get some algae there. Those will be some decent ingredients to start a new colony. Okay, let's go up to 6,000. And now let's add algae. I, I wish there was some way I could like kind of pick and choose what to go. Heck, I don't even know if I have that much algae around. And there's a chance they'll keep grabbing lead. Let's stop sweeping lead. All right, let's find algae. Let's sweep some of this stuff up. Sweep. Algae's kind of a mess. Looks like it's scattered all over the map. map. Probably enough. Let's see what's going on with the rocket ship. They're delivering algae. Copper, sand, lead, algae. Okay, let's uh looks good so far. Let's consider I'm gonna slow it down even more and figure out who's going to fly this rocket ship. Let's see skills. Uh, wait, did I have someone that was fast running around? Someone who had a taste for Suit wearing, maybe Ada? Let's see if anyone else has a taste for suit wearing or rocketry. All right, Marie, oh, the artist. Um, she's already at 12. Oh, this is tempting. She, her, her morale is already pretty low, and I think that when they send somebody up, they're going to get stressed out. So I think Ada will be our pilot. For now. Alright, how are we doing? Still delivering stuff? So if Ada's going to go up here... Let's see, do we have food? We have got food in there. Oxygen is up to 3,000... Almost 4K. So let's get a little more oxygen here, because it's I don't know how long it'll take for her to get to the planet and back, but we're close. Maybe when it's about 7,000, she can go. It's going to be stressful. How are we doing here? We have got a rocket. I mean a telescope. I can peek in here, get a little free food. Get rid of this slimy stuff. A lot of mud. Yeah, just I want it to stop off gassing, venting out garbage. Oh, looks like more free food in here even. Oh, that's free food sitting on some uh, toxic crap. Some polluted dirt. But let's uh, make that all 
accessible. And I maybe I'll start to sweep up all this stuff too at some point. Let's go ahead and sweep up. Sweep up the junk. Ooh, even more free food over here. Alright. Uh, this was a mess. Do I need... Yeah, let's get this refrigerator. I'm just going to empty it for now. I was thinking eventually of perhaps moving the petroleum generator up into this neighborhood so that I could have a, like a power backbone over here. Okay, no polluted water available. That's fine. I'm sure I'll get some polluted water sooner or later. I think there's gulpfish are slowly converting all the polluted water into regular water. And I'm, I'm okay with that, I think. Okay, that refrigerator's empty. Let's put it back. So we're going in slow motion here. Let's sweep this up. Let's see if the rocket's ready to go. We'll speed it up. How are we doing for the rocket? Close. A little bit more algae. And a little more gas. Let's uh let's make this a higher priority. A little more gas oxygen. A little more algae. Sweep that up. Maybe mop up some of this uh filth. How's the oxygen levels doing? Still terrible? Yeah, it's terrible and getting worse, maybe. These are running. Let's see. A little oxygen's coming out here. I want to fin let's finish this pipe and send some more oxygen down to here. What's going on? Why is it not sending any oxygen up? Some oxygen should be coming here. Oh, this is sent to go the wrong direction. I've got a bridge. The heck is that bridge doing there? I wonder if that was a misclick. Yeah, that bridge is confusing matters. It's not setting oxygen up with this bridge built here. This is clogged up, so any extra carbon should be just going to the other planet. Maybe this is shut off just because we're done with carbon down here? Yeah, it's got a layer of oxygen. So if I want another carbon delivery system, I want to come down here and say, hey, if you see any carbon, carbon dioxide, let's start shipping it out of here. Vacuum it up, send it away. carbon dioxide. Let's go up. And while I'm at it, let's let the carbon dioxide from the right from the cop or from the plastics join in. This I think was probably old chlorine. All right, let's send our carbon dioxide. It's kind of roundabout, but I'm going to join it up with this other carbon dioxide. Which will then circulate around and go to, um, you know, it'll first try to go to the other, it might try to go to the other planet, might go to the rocket ship, whatever. Let's make sure I can build this stuff. A little squeeze for space. How's the rocket doing? Two, three, four. Could use some more algae.
Oh, these are just little tiny packets of algae. But I'll sweep them. And let's see if how that, um, how our steam chamber's doing. If they finish building the, the tiles. Still a vacuum. Plumbing is done. I think I can seal it. Let's seal it and make sure I'm baking it out of ceramic. When that's done, this will be pretty good here. Then it's a matter of no power, but you know, just finishing building all this stuff up here. You know, insulating everything. I think that's all low priority stuff. Rocket ship, how are we doing? Do I have more oxygen coming up here yet? No oxygen. That is the holdup. Um, oh, it deconstructed the wrong thing. Let's go. I want the oxygen going up. You know what? I'm not even going to rebuild this for now because I want to send a bunch of oxygen up to the... Um, up to the canister emptier up there. Canister filler. All right, so now we got oxygen going up. And I'm close to being able to launch that rocket. Let's check the rocket. Algae, almost filled. We got copper, sand, and lead. Oh, I was thinking glass I wanted to do also. Oh, maybe that'll be another trip. Maybe I'll look in here, and I'll do the glass over here. Something like that. So when this rocket will eventually land on the planet, once I've built a base over there, and then I can drop off the glass and maybe build some solar panels on the new planet. But in the meantime, the crew, we've got a pilot. The destination will be to orbit this little planet right there. But not ready for launch yet. A little bit more algae. Let's see how we're doing for glass. Not that I need it now, but I will. Solid glass. Looks like I've got a bunch. You know, I might want to even put in some more some more solar panels just for a little bonus energy I'll put another solar panel in there how are we doing for oxygen okay we've got a flow going up how's it going down below Still haven't built this stuff. Let's get this going. I'd like to see... The oxygen is a little... Th oh, it's getting better. It was thin. It's getting better. And this is a ton of carbon dioxide. Eventually we can start sucking this carbon dioxide out. Yeah, we'll feed the carbon dioxide. That should should work. Let's see how the other Picato is doing. Uh, except for our water spill. Doesn't look too shabby. Let's start cleaning this up. We've got bristle blossoms in gear. Let's make sure where I'm prepared to cook them in a gristle berry. Lots of food. 91% 74. When those are done, I think I'll dig those up. Let's see what we're doing for research. Um, looks like we got some mud here to dig up. Looks 
looks like they could reach that. Let's do some more sweeping up. It'd be nice once I get all this stuff cleaned up. Yeah, they've got digging they could do if they feel like it. Sweeping they can do. Plenty of work over here. Alright, these guys should be pretty happy, no stress. Three of them at work. How are we doing for oxygen suits? Two oxygen suits and a spare if they need it. Alright. Let's look at the rocket. Is it time? Close. 300 kilograms of algae yet? As long as I'm sending it, I want to make sure I've got everything topped off. Let's sweep some more algae. You know, I'm going to put a, give it a 9. That should be plenty of algae. Right, they're working on the the fire pole is getting done. I could maybe dig up a little extra copper here so I could increase my fire pole. More fire pole materials. How are we doing? Hundred more kilograms of algae, and then go for it. Oh, and then we're delivering more oxygen. And they've delivered some, oh, they've delivered a lot of glass. That's plenty of glass. That's enough glass for like six. Okay, let's turn that off. But I guess if you feel like it, we can always use a little bit of sand. Is there anything else we might want over there? I'm sort of tempted to send some seeds, maybe. Um... Maybe some grub fruits or something? Grub fruits or mealwoods? You know, I'm not in a big rush. Because I, I know that planet's going to have pips, so I could do a little bit of wild planting. Alright, how are we doing? Uh, what's going on? Why are they... Let's make it sweep only. So we don't have this infinite loop go issue going on. Oxygen's up to 6 kilograms. I think we're ready to launch it. Six kilograms. Hope we have enough air to get there and back. All right. Uh, ready to launch. Cargo loading complete. Doesn't say that. I think we can acknowledge the warnings. The crew will get in there. Oh, yeah. One more packet of oxygen, just in case. All right. And now let's launch. Let's get our pilot in there. And fly away. We'll drop off a rover and a whole bunch of building blocks. Oh, it's only got 59 out of 6,000. Well, that's fine. New printables available. Oh, a whole bunch of Pakus. That is very, very tempting. It might be even more tempting on this other planet. If I drop off the Pakus, they can make their way down into this giant pool of water. And maybe they won't be overcrowded. Let's give that a shot. And let's go back up and see if the rocket's going. Come on, rocket. Would have been nice to get a little more algae in there. For all I know, they're just dropping off the algae over in um, one of these places. Rocket? Why aren't we launching? You know what? Let's check the priorities. Let's make sure that uh, Ada is actually going to focus on a little bit of rocketing. There she goes! You can do it, Ada! Drop off some algae. More algae. Uh, Al, uh, uh, what's going on? 
No errands. Oh, begin launch sequence. I first I had to acknowledge warnings and then I had to begin launch sequence. And we're off. Unpermitted food. Okay, so Ada, the only food she has is this muckroot, which is fine. Consumables. She is a pilot. Okay, those people don't need here, but Ada, let's get the muckroot for you. Alright. She's hungry. I see a little drool. I think she's probably going to need to use the bathroom pretty soon and probably pee on the floor. Stress is something I'm going to have to care about. Let's see the star map. It's going to take her almost six tenths of a cycle, so probably morning. She should be in orbit. see what we got going on here. Got a little building to do. Still no power to here. Alright, I think now it's time I can get the action going back to the feed oxygen so that I can start actually using this area. The atmosphere dock. Um, how are we doing for these? No rad bolts. Eight rad bolts. Research. Could use rad bolts. Uh, maybe do I want to turn that on again or not? Ten cycles and I'll start getting natural gas again. That will help. I will no longer be running at a power deficit with rolling brownouts. Made a mess. Yeah, that's Ada. Sorry about that, Ada. Hop it up. It could be hard being a pilot. Alright, so when this starts providing natural gas, is it enough just to have these four reservoirs? Or do I want to make some room over here for some more? Um, let's go ahead. Low priority builds, but we can do it. Does this fit two side by side? want to see how far out they're going to come. I'd like to make it look a little bit even at least. All right. And if I go up further, I'm going to lose those things. Yeah, that's, we'll just squeeze a little bit of, um, some of this out, take some of that out. Gas pipes were coming in, coming out. Looks like I got a little bit of a log jam if I were to try to pass through here. This oxygen is finally venting. Let's um, extend this oxygen as well. I don't want it to go to the mushrooms. Mushrooms need that nice carbon dioxide atmosphere. Oops. But I could come under the mushrooms. And send some more oxygen down here. Send some more oxygen down here, force the carbon dioxide. Carbon dioxide can pump. How are we doing? Oh, 
What did I just see here? I thought I just saw something that I needed to look at. Certainly don't know what this is doing anymore. Oh, it's still dripping. There's probably ice melting way up high. So if I were to pass carbon di I mean natural gas over this way, I will need Oh, this is pumping oxygen even? It's kind of a mishmash of stuff. I guess that's okay. Oh, is it, it's morning. They, she's probably already finished the um, the star map. Yeah, she's been in orbit already. Oh, sorry about that, Ada. All right, let's uh, deploy the rover module. Where do we want to land? We've got this big surface area. Nice forest asteroid. Pretty much anywhere. I'm trying to look for a little water or something if I wanted to make like a water lock. I'm not seeing anything special. So let's just uh, drop off from this pit. And let's also check out, let's deploy the cargo modules. So that's gonna launch and they're all gonna pour down and land on the surface. And then let's change and go back and land so you can relax a little bit. Let's see how stressed out she is. Stress is 32%. Yep, that's not very good. Popped eardrums, low morale, and hungry. Well, you've got food in there. But. Okay. Let's see our new planet. Ooh. Um, didn't I land a rocket ship here? I thought I landed a rover. Did something go wrong? I deployed the rover. Got to okay. Let's um. Let's stay here. The rover should have been deployed. I'm not seeing the rover. What happened to it? I thought it was right there in that hole. That looks like a glitch. All right, I'm sorry about this. I'm gonna go back to my save. You know, do I wanna go back to a save game? Maybe I'll just fly there with another rover? That's too bad. Maybe I should have stopped and watched to make sure that the rover landed before I dropped off all these, um, the payload. All right, so, oh no, it says deploy. Okay, let's try again, deploy it. All right, now I'm gonna look at the planet. Let's see if it comes down. Oh, there it goes. All right, now let's send the rocket home. Ada, she can finally fly home. All right, you can fly there. Planet. Let's start emptying all these payloads. And once all these payloads are emptied, I will get a better view of maybe where to start going underground here. I wish there was a way to see empty all. Yeah, there must be a better way of doing this. I just don't know what it is. If you know, put it in the comments, please. Even a shortcut key like E. Can I click off? Nope. Okay. Yep, 
go around, empty all these out. That should give me a little bit of lead, a little copper, a little algae. Once they're empty, then we will dig into the planet and try setting up for, um... Those are two here? Yeah, then we'll dig into the planet and start making, uh, living quarters for their first colonist. Vitalial. Ventilation. Okay. Oxygen heading down. Carbon dioxide heading up. Natural gas coming across. Why is no... Oh, cause it... There we go. Alright, ventilation. Let's bring it up. And feed these. Feed these. Made a mess again. Sorry, Ada. How stressed are you? 58%. Okay, don't start breaking things. You'll be home soon. You will be home soon, star map. Yeah, you're almost home. Alright, and then... in here. Another bridge. Put a bridge there. And then this is where our natural gas will feed these three power stations. Let's make sure we've got heavy watt wire running all the way to the battery. Alright, idle. Ada, she's still idle. Well, she lands soon and then everything will be alright. we doing here? Still need some building. Not sure why this is... Maybe it's low party because they have to kind of round, run roundabout so much. Or maybe I made it a four priority. Let's just get this done. I'd sort of like to get, to get that done so I can start testing out the new refinery. I only have one of them powered, only this one's powered for now. And maybe we'll get some sweeping done. Although some of this is what? Oil? I don't know if they have a place to deposit that oil. I could think about how I'm going to make a cooling loop here. Maybe I'll start with a short cooling loop just to cool the met refineries and the steam turbines. Lead pipes, perhaps? Okay, let's run some lead pipes right along here.
let's go granite underneath here. I think they sometimes have better luck, like transmitting um, temperature exchange through solid tiles. So let's go with radiant liquid pipes again. Oops, lead right through these tiles here underneath. Let's uh, put a few bridges in here in case I need to sort of change and redirect. The flow, oh, and I need to fill this up with, um, like polluted water makes a good medium, a good coolant. So do I have much polluted water left? This polluted water is getting kind of low. Let's take a peek around if there's other polluted water. Oh, we've got the cool slush up there. Haven't dipped into it yet. Hi, Stress. How's Ada doing? Is she getting some rest? Oh, she's even getting a massage. There you go. After that long journey into space. Got a lot of polluted water here, but that seems like a long ways to go for the polluted water. All right, um, maybe I could use salt water. I think salt water might not be as, I mean, it's not quite as good as polluted water, but not terrible. All right, let's try to get polluted water up there. Um, these, Running down. I think these are all empty. Oh, what do I have here? So this is a problem. This is done and I'm not feeding new water in. That's what I was doing. I was taking hot water from this refinery. Alright. And that was that was the source of the salt water which was feeding my oxygen tanks. So instead, let's run it right up to here. Do I run it right there? Where do I run it? That's salt water. It has to be purified first. Okay, so that has to go to here first. It'll go up to there. It'll get held in these tanks for a little bit. Why are these not running? These should be feeding into this. Brine should be coming down, feeding into here. What's wrong with this desalinator? Oh, I broke those pipes. Okay, let's get that brine down there. Let's feed that up. Let's no longer send down to here. These was uh, no longer needed. Oops, I no longer need all these. It was good while it lasted, but just don't need them. Right, let's see what's happening with this. Water's coming down, back up. It's making a big loop. Eventually, I'll make the shorter loop. All right, let's check out the new planet. Still emptying. Can they reach? They can't get all the way to the bottom here. So let's. That should let them get down there. Oh, and they're almost done. Everything else almost emptied. Empty storage. And maybe then I'll go ahead. What am I digging up? Gold, gold, aluminum ore, gold. Aluminum ore, gold, aluminum ore. This is a lot of metal. 
There's a little igneous rock. Let's... Gold and aluminum. Wow. Okay, let's dig that so I get a little bit of aluminum uh, igneous rock. Once I do that, I will build a little uh, storage place to dump all this stuff in. And then I will start burrowing down to access these chambers below. Here's a good place. Oh, so if new colonists come down, we've got some water. Oh, space floating in the middle of this asteroid? That is crazy. Oh, and it would, it's going to vacuum out all of the... That's too bad. I'm going to lose all this oxygen stored in here. Unless I can come up... I've never seen a Swiss cheese asteroid like this. Very strange. Who's idle? Ruby is idle. Um, why are you idle? Oh yeah, you've done finished digging. We've got sweeping to do. Maybe dig a little bit more. Oh, let's check the rocket ship. Uh... Rocket ship. I am no longer need this orbital cargo, so let's deconstruct that. The rover, let's deconstruct the rover. Let's actually change it and get a trailblazer so I can send a colonist. And we'll trailblaze and make it out of copper. Um, I'll just take some blossom seeds for now. Oh yeah, let's uh, sweep up some stuff. I was going to send some blossom seeds and some mealwood seeds up into that rocket ship. Glass is already up there. We've already got a little bit of sand. Maybe I'll throw a little more sand up there. I don't know if that's getting dropped off. Water is a problem. Let's get the water flowing. I mean, the water which is feeding the air is not flowing. That's the problem. Let's get that running. And I think I've heard that the more alternate routes that dupes have to travel around, the slower the pathfinding and the, um, like, the worse it is for for frames. So I might cap off some of this. Let's see about making it. It's going to be a little slower. Oops. Yeah, you can start going a long way around. I don't know that I'm going to put anything here even. I'm just kind of building floors in. Construct that. And I might even close this off. Or at least let's make it so dupes aren't running back and forth, but air can flow down to my carbon sink down here. What's coming over here? What's all this? Fossil. Oh, yeah, fossil. And then you're going to be grinding up the fossil. Let's get that's a job you guys can do. Let's make some more lime. This is not powered yet. And the piping is not done yet. Oh, I was I was working on getting uh, polluted oxygen. Let's look at our other topiola. All right, still opening stuff. 
it looks like they did dig up the igneous rock. So let's make a storage bin. And then since this is a vacuum anyway, I can dig down into there and maybe seal it up. Oops. I don't even know if I can make an airlock door. I don't know if there's space exposure behind there. Yeah, space exposure. All right. So I don't know if I'll even get here in time, which will make it really difficult. I've got to get a, a spot before this guy runs out of power. I have to somehow get down into the... Um... Oh, he's got a lot of battery power left. I need to get down in here and make a place for duplicates to go where they can get fresh oxygen when I try to colonize that planet. I think that should be my number one priority is just to get a, a path in. Let's dump some of this fresh water down here. Sweep up all this stuff. Sweep up stuff. Um, I'm pretty sure I don't need the bog buckets anymore. Deconstruct that and hope he doesn't fall down. Oh, all these fish are flopping. Uh, fish, why aren't you making it? You should make it to that big pool of water. Let me just block that off just to make sure they don't... Um... I would have expected them to have made that flop over here and flop down long ago. Oh, maybe they were going to flop and they would have landed in the in the refrigerator. That might have been the problem. All right, let's put a compost pile over here as well. Oops. Dealing with a little bit of lag. I hope you guys are, whoever's watching this, I hope you have it on like 1.5 speed because this must be a, a little bit slow to watch as I fumble around and try to get the right keystrokes. Uh, let's check the planet. I think we're going to be good for now. Let's uh, store. This will be lower priority, but I will store the random stuff in here. You know, we've got the the metal ores, the filtration ingre ingredients, and the algae. But then let's dig down and think about the best way in here. Still space exposure, no space exposure. Let's get an airlock. And then let's see if I can... 
Oh, I can't even build an airlock. But if I go like this... And I send a colonist to this asteroid, they will at least have a route that will get them to fresh oxygen. A little pocket of oxygen. They can breathe and then work on, oh, we want to seal this area up too. But that's going to be a lower priority. Let's just... Uh, I'm going to have to wait till I dig up some more materials to actually get that done. This manual airlock's never going to get done. Let's make sure I don't let, seal it off totally. Alright. I think I'm going to call it for the day. Let's check on the spaceship to see if we're ready to send a... That's still a rover module? I thought I swapped that for a trailblazer module made of copper. Let's build that. Oh, there it goes. I need to fill a little more... Carbon dioxide before I'm ready to launch. Oh boy, big chunks of polluted oxygen. I wonder if I should be running a filter on these things. Alright, so next time we'll send an actual colonist to try it up land on that planet. Maybe I'll have... Oh, is this ready to go? It's got... Yes. I'm going to try a little bit here. Let's try a little time, a little bit. Just to run that refinery a little bit and see what happens. Yeah, so it's going to be more a matter now of doing some cleanup work. Maybe getting the electrical grid a little bit more whipped into shape. and starting to colonize the other planets. I haven't needed these in a long time, and I, oops, don't think I will need them. All right, I'll pause it there, and I hope to see you next time. Thank you for watching.